Hey guys, in this video, I will be presenting you the strategies to select winning affiliate products for maximizing your income. There are lakhs and lakhs of affiliate products for you to promote online. But the thing is that you need to select an affiliate product that is relevant to your niche and it's of highest quality. You can make use of several affiliate marketplaces to discover the kind of affiliate products that you need to pro, uh, promote. There are different affiliate marketplaces that you can make use of to discover the kind of products that you need to promote. And you need to pay extreme attention to the quality of the product and make sure that people are actually buying uh, the affiliate product because conversions matters a lot. Sales is equal to commission. You need to remember that in mind. How to find uh, affiliate products that really make you rich? right so there are tons of affiliate products in the marketplaces right so but you need to learn the art of picking up the right products that feel uh, that resonate with you and your audience that you feel that you're uh, knowledgeable about and that you have a good feeling about that product right so how to do proper affiliate product selection so first you need to determine what niche that product is in and uh, say if it's in digital marketing niche right if it's a digital marketing related product you need to ask yourself whether i'm really knowledgeable about digital marketing to promote this product right if you don't have knowledge about the uh, niche um, in which you're promoting right so never pick the product that is irrelevant to your niche for example i never promote health or fitness related product because i'm not knowledgeable about fitness nutrients and all so you need to only select the product which is related to your niche that you are knowledgeable about and the need of the affiliate solid product as i told you in one of my earlier videos uh, in the first module so there should be a need for what we do right if there is a product and uh, it is not solving a particular uh, very serious problem in the marketplace right um, don't go for it if it's a generic affiliate product that's not um, addressing the problem of the um, people right in a concise way uh, it should be the product should be solving a burning problem right suppose if you take the example of uh, uh, one tool called uh, connect explore right it helps you uh, to run facebook ads in an effective way by knowing uh, what people convert well according to their interests right to target interest on facebook right and uh, facebook don't allow you to see what uh, what people um, convert well right the people who convert well according to their interests but this tool breaks it down and uh, lets you know what are all the interests that are converting well right there is a need of the affiliate product for the people who run facebook advertising right so there should be a need of the product and it should solve a burning problem right and you also need to look at the market reach right so any affiliate product cater a specific segment of audience for example that connect reach app i told you especially targets the people who run facebook advertisements right a specific segment like that there are uh, many products that uh, target specific segments of people to market but you need to determine uh, that uh, there is wide enough reach for you to market you should not uh, market a product right uh, whose potential uh, um, reach is only like 5000 people or 10000 people or 50000 people right you will limit yourself if you are picking up the products make sure that the market reach is really huge so in case if you are working in a niche you need to find a, a product that has a wide reach um, by which uh, there are there is a wide range of people who are benefited from it right and the Fourth one is you need to look at whether they have related products in their suite, right? So if there is only one product by a particular um, developer or a company, don't promote it uh, over other uh, affiliate programs which have an entire suite of products. You know what I'm saying, right? So for example, you know Thrive Themes. They have some conversion uh, boosting plugins for WordPress, right? Um, they have multiple products in their suite like Thrive Architect, Thrive Leads, Thrive Apprentice, and many other products. Uh, the product that you're willing to promote should have that kind of suite of products because uh, you will earn more money down the lane um, if your customers buy the products that they are upsold to or uh, that they buy down the lane, 
right? Um, related products should be there in the suite uh, that you are uh, promoting. And you need to also look whether there are other big affiliates uh, promoting the product that you are now promoting, right? Because uh, um, if any product has other big affiliates promoting it, then it means it's a tested market. It's a tested market. Then you can just blindly go ahead and promote the product if it uh, satisfies all these conditions, right? So you need to only promote the products that you have bought. In the previous, uh, in one of my previous videos, in the first module, I told you one quote, right? Selling is the transfer of feelings. You won't get feelings to transfer, right? You won't get feelings if you have not uh, bought the product, right? You should have feelings about the product. If you don't have feelings about a product, you can't transfer your feelings, hence you can't sell effectively. And also you need to determine how easily people convert. There's a term called EPC. It stands for earnings per click. For example, if there's a product of uh, $100, Right, and if the commission rate is fifty dollars, right, and if you drive uh, ten visitors uh, to that offer, right, ten clicks to the affiliate link, and suppose if one person buys the product, then your earnings is fifty dollars, right? Ten people gave you fifty dollars. One person bought the product, right, and then uh, the EPC, the earning per click, will be like fifty by ten, right? So it's five dollars. It means uh, if you drive for each click you drive to the product page via your affiliate link, you are earning five dollars, right? So this metric will be mentioned in the uh, marketplaces, and uh, you can email the product creator regarding um, informing you about uh, the EPC that they are getting from their affiliates, right? So you need to determine uh, the convertibility of a product because uh, if the convertibility or EPC of a product is high, then it means there is a, a huge demand for the product. There is a huge need you need to determine whether there is a huge need of an affiliate product in the marketplace and getting to know about um, EPC uh, makes you easier to determine the need of the affiliate product. Right? These are all the criteria that you need to keep in mind when choosing a product to promote. And also, as I told you, you need to promote only a couple of products, right? whether uh, in blogging or in any other digital marketing, affiliate marketing fields. Um, you need to learn promoting only a couple of products that you use in various ways like video marketing, uh, comparison with other products, you know, alternative kind of posts, right? And um, there are many ways, right? Hope you guys found this uh, video helpful. Hey guys, hope you found this video on choosing best affiliate products to promote helpful. And selecting good affiliate products is very important. Hope you realized it. If you have any doubts, just leave them in the comment section below. See you in my next video, guys.